Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Star Traders Frontiers. I'm your host, Colors Fade. It's episode 13. And we have this one mission right now, which is to help this smuggler become a smuggler prince. This this is an unlock. It's one of the ones you can actually do in normal mode. Um, I'm not exactly sure what's what it entails, because I've never even tried to touch it before. So we're gonna we're gonna see what we can do. Amatzir. All right. Your crowning plan is a top priority, which tells me that. Okay. All right. So we just have to do stuff for her. I'm not a hundred percent sure what she's got going on here. In preparation for orchestrated wave of shortages, we must help smuggler Amat build up a massive reserve of vodka. Oh right. And we don't exactly have the cargo space for that. Oh, first of all, we have to find it. Okay. <laughs> we have 11 years on these missions. So we need to be finding some other missions to do while we're, while we're looking at this. To earn enough money to get our, our ship here. But let's take a look at places that could sell vodka. And our trade licenses that we're going to need to do some of this. So... First, let's level up a couple of people so I can wrap my brain around the idea of what has to be done. Oh my gosh. Okay. Because there's a lot going on here. <laughs> this person... What's some cool stuff they have? So what your bounty hunter here has... Actually, if we go... Let's go look at... Bounty hunter is this thing. So this is Exoscout. Okay. Exoscout. So down here. The Exoscout has a couple of cool things that only work against Xenos. This is nice. Uh, plus 10 range accuracy. Successful hit causes minus 4 initiative. You you want to have this when you start fighting Xenos, basically. This is a good one to have. Uh, we're not really there with fighting Xenos. This is also in crew combat against Xenos only. Uh, causes a Xeno to have minus 25 deflection, range defense, 40 armor, minus 16 energy. Again, it's a nice one versus Xenos. We're not quite there yet. This is a crippling attack. I mean, we we may run into Xenos, but we're not going out looking for them yet. And there's not a there is a main story kind of mission sequence coming along later where where we're going to be fighting some really hard Xenos, and we're going to want all that stuff. But for right now, I think we're okay without it. Plus twenty plasma damage, plus ten armor piercing. Successful hit causes minus twenty five armor, minus sixteen energy resist, knocks target back one slide. This is nice. Does a bunch of stuff. There's a couple other down here. Um, crippling rifle attack causes four bleeding and minus armor. So it's nice. I want this though. Plas charge. I like that. I like that. Plus it knocks a target back, which. Sometimes the swordsman gets in the second slot, and if you can knock him back one more, then they can't swing in anything, and then they have to waste a turn. They have to waste a bunch of initiative moving back up, so it's really nice to have a couple of those abilities. And then our captain. Our commander. Get him up to level 11. Oh, we can. There he goes. All right. So, let's go do some looking. Um, where I'm going to start... And I'll edit this out. But where I'm going to start is basically doing this bit of business and inspecting the system atlas. And you can go down here and you can look and say, okay, uh, who has vodka? First of all, you want to do the smart thing. Since I'm not familiar with all the goods. Uh, and you want to look at, okay, we have to go back to her. We have to take this quest. Missions, we have to take it. And it says, where did... Where is Vodka? Farming and refinery zones with trade loss 7 or less. So that's where we start. So we're going to grab this quest. Hopefully I can pull this off. And then we're going to take a look using the star map. And you can go in here in places like this and say, okay, who's got what? Farming and trade. Right? Wait, is that what it said? Oh my god, I'm so bad at this. Ocean of Vodka. Farming refinery zones. Okay. Farming and refinery zones. So right here, we saw this is a Kadar farming. This is Steel Song refinery. Do they have any vodka? It'll be, yeah, it's right there. And it looks like that. 
Okay, so that's the starter point. And while we're looking at this screenshot right here, notice that this place sells it and there's a refinery right here and they have it, so that's good. Uh, Steel Song Farming, they don't have it, so that's fine. Uh, is there an independent system nearby that has it? This is Tradeway, so they're not going to have it, and we haven't landed on there. There's the capital. Um, they buy it, but we're not trying to buy it. We're trying to stockpile it. <laughs> so there's a couple places we can go to actually try and buy it, and there's an indie mining place, but they're going to have mining stuff again. So they buy Budka. They're like, hell yeah, we're happy to have some of that. Um, and Steel Song. This is Steel Song Farming Zone that has it, and the other one also has it. So we can get some here. So let's navigate. And while we're here, let's also talk to our people and get more missions. Something else that might help us. Okay, what are these? One way mission, a blockade. This, this is also a blockade. Five jumps to search for a criminal band on the surface. Where is it at? Ryan's Edge. Where is Ryan's Edge? Is it way up here? I think it's way up here. It is. It's up past Infinite Helix. I don't want to go there. This is in Valde Belt and Cobras Helix. And this is in Fifth Divide. Oh, Fifth Divide is closed. I know it's not as much money, but I'm familiar with Fifth Divide. I can handle that. The Princess. She has some missions here, and we're just going to try to figure out what pays the most. She's got seven jumps to Nadello Vortex or 12 jumps to Juhetti Spiral. That one we know where that is. That's over here. Oh no. I thought it was over here. Never mind. That's because uh, it's because of partial synesthesia and N and the J have the same similar color in my mind. So I associate them together. Um, Yeah, it's way over here. Ooh. And so where was the other one? Nadello Vortex. Hmm. Where's that at? Don't tell me it's up here. Oh, it's way up there. <sighs> okay. Mm, I bet you can find some more quests over here by the Juhayati Spiral. So, how long? What? What? Actually, here's the next good question to ask. What has the longest amount of time on it between these battle missions? This one does. So, even though it's the Nadello Vortex, it's, it's a, five years, 37 weeks. We may find ourselves up there. So... Let's get it. Remember, this mission will require at least one empty prison cell. We got prison cells. All right. Next. So, buy cargo. Actually, do we have some to sell? Xeno Terror artifacts. We got to get into a black market. That's right. This is going to make it hard until we get into a black market. So, Vodka. Alphabetize this stuff. Vodka. Purchase that. Now, who has access to a black market? Let's take a look. Nearest black market person right here. Oh, so it was... Oh, our smuggler friend. Yeah, can you get us into the black market there, honey? Okay. We gotta navigate back to her. I think she... Uh, I think the reason we're doing this is because we couldn't get in the black market. We don't have enough. Oh, but we do have enough access now. Good, let's sell these things. All right. Rep lost confiscate illegal type. This is there's no point going to the black market if it gets confiscated. So you got to get rid of that one. Repeat. Confiscate illegal type. Get out of here. Contact news as if free trader permit. Yay. All right, we need to sell these. It's free money for us. Illegal trade house commands access to certain trade goods. This black market trades equivalent to a free trader's permit and therefore lacks the ability to move Terox Xeno artifacts. Oh, okay. Um, well, like I said in episode one, some of the f best advice I got was to take notes. And I'm now going to take notes for this. Black markets that can't handle Xeno artifacts. So she is not one of them. All right. In that case, we have to find someone who can. So the question is, who actually will have, will take Xeno artifacts? And I'm very briefly going to check and see if there's somewhere on the internet that tells me, because that would be really useful. So there is this. You can also sell them at independent 
places if they have a trade law, two or lower. Cesarate, the Lyrich and its NX is uh, independent mining, and they have a trade law too. So we're going to go there. Right here. They don't have a black market. She's the black market. She's not going to give us access. But can we just sell them here? Yes. No permit required. Okay. For 16K, you don't get as much money. I think you might get more on the black market, but still we can get rid of them, which is the important thing. <laughs> there doesn't happen to be any vodka here, does there? <laughs> no. Okay. But now at least we can go buy more vodka. So that's something to keep in mind here. Um, there are independent places again remember it's going to have trade law two or less but this is worth noting so what do we have to take this vodka let's see ocean of vodka oh we have to make jumps oh god we have to make jumps okay <laughs> well then to go back to the places that are going to buy vodka for us let's do that and it's a good note it's a good idea to take notice of some of these systems that sell certain things because you'll see them over and over in the game uh vodka is one of them crystals is another one medical supplies is another one actually you're really going to want to make uh use of that later like this basic medicines um is one of the most common things these missions pop up over and over and over again so take some notes where they're going to be at any rate I, while we're here, let's take a look real quick. Lyrich Annex. I'm not worried about that. Let's go to Steel Song Prima is one of them that sells vodka. But I also want to look at my ship. Because what are we? We have that much cargo. This is a fuel boost that adds 160. But if you wanted to replace it for cargo, you get 40 cargo. What, how big can you go? Cargo hold. 45 cargo, 70 fuel capacity. How much is this? 164. Oh, man, that's painful. That's really painful. What's 260 for fuel? Oh, man. This is painful to think about having to remove something like that and replace it. Um... Okay, hold on. We have no passengers. No passengers, but replacing... Oh, we have two prison cells. And we have no passenger capability. Huh. Okay. <laughs> this is just super painful to do. I don't want to get rid of that fuel. But we have to make many, many trips to do this. If we don't change this out. This is like... Um... Okay, hold on. Let's go back. Back, back, back. Upgrade ship. I'm lost here. This is currently 25. Cargo adds 40 fuel capacity. If you wanted to add 45 cargo, it'd be 70 fuel capacity. Man, I hate spending all this money we've worked up, but let's do it. 15 weeks. Oh, oh that hurts. We could just be traveling and grabbing vodka. You know what? I'm going to leave my damn ship the way it is, and we're just going to do it the hard way. Okay. Vodka. Land. Give me the vodka. Let's do it. A plus. Give it to me. A minus. All right. So, where do we have to take it? Oh, shit. Two jumps. Ooh, let's see if we can find a closer place along the way, then. Because you're going to have to make five trips. And that's a lot of trips. Alright, in this system, what do we have? We're in Cadrino Chaos. And really, the only places that we could do it from are Independence or Steel Song. Alta Mesa, what kind of relationship would do? It doesn't matter. We don't have a trade with them. So that's, the, that's part of the problem. There's farming here from Toymoto Prime, and they have it. And it's kind of, it's kind of highlighted. What's that mean? Hmm. And there's no steel song here. Yeah, there's no steel song. Okay, well, let's go hand this stuff off. Hold on. I'm going to look at that again. 
Here's what I'm looking at. This, they got it kind of highlighted. Does that mean that it's there, but I can't trade it because I don't have the right trade thing? This is five AUs away. Let's go. Let's go look. Luxury rations, but we can buy vodka here. Oh, great. Okay, so... This is who? These people. Clan Alta Mesa. Apparently we can buy from them because we have the right trade license. So this particular zone is loaded with refineries and farming stuff. It's great. You've And with a couple different factions. So we should be able to just keep buying vodka from here and taking it to where we need to go. Uh, hopefully. We're going to find out about that. But the fact that we can buy it from here is great. So let's do that. Ocean of Vodka. We're crammed for time. Oh no. No. Okay, skip off the void. Xeno fleet. Yeah, that's the... That's the thing that's going to make it a little bit difficult, isn't it? And then what about this system? Let's go load here and look. There's... A, uh-oh, ship contact, and they are independent. Well, guess what? Sorry. Bad day for you, but I need all the cash I can get. Closing distance. He's like, whoa, I've heard about you guys. You're bad. Ooh, he hit me. Okay. Range three. Well, let's let's put the hurt on him. Oh, he's he's got a little craft there. He's a tiny ship, so that I would assume that he doesn't have any more than one. Maybe. Um. Let's look at what else we want to do here. Inability to launch craft. That's a great one. I'm just going to rake him from shields here. Lower his shields. Oh, he's got two craft. Okay. Then. Oh, and he backed up a little bit. Well, trying to get out of range? Is that what you're trying to do there, Buster? Alrighty. He strafed me and missed. Oh, he hit that guy. I don't think I've ever blown up one of the crafts. Let's go for... Yeah, there's this debuffs craft. It could be better just to kill this guy as quickly as we can. As quickly as possible. This might be it. Yeah, there it goes. That last shot. Not enough hole, baby. We're going to battle damage repair ourselves. Salvage. 31k. That's nice. Okay. Ocean of Vodka. We have to go land in Ocean of Vodka. Stash it. Let's, let's see how much more we can find in this system here actually just we got to do this orbit land fuel pay the crew their wages I don't want to heal because we're gonna it's gonna take time <laughs> so I don't want to do that or repair my ship that's gonna take time too let's see if we can sneak our way out of this all right he's got more skills let's take a look so this person gets a nice little buff called Frontline Brave that they can use from the top two positions. Plus two initiative for the whole team. Plus ten all damage critical on armor. I like that. So 
I'm going to grab that. Pilot. Going around here. What do we What do we need? Autom automatic pass field pilot test. We got six of those. Three of those. Sharp steering. Two of those. Three broadsides. Five twitches. Spine. We got a bunch of those. <laughs> Forward thrusters, we have two wild flying I don't use because I don't like the self inflicted damage. Um, so I think I'll just fail pilot test. Let's grab those. All right, who's going to pay for vodka in the system? Oh, there can't be any system, in, there can't be any vodka here, can there? No, all right, we wouldn't be that lucky. So in this system, there's an orbital, there's a refinery right there. I don't know if we have, this is who, Clan Javit. I don't know if we have the proper trade with them or not. So we need to go look first, buy cargo. There's no vodka here. Okay, who does have vodka? Anybody else would have it here? Orbital, 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 orbital. There's lots of orbitals here. There's nobody that would have vodka. You can, you'd have to land at all these to be sure, but let's say System Atlas and go look. High tech refiner. This is the only one that would have it and it's not listed as a good for them. So uh, Steel Song Orbital. They're not going to sell it. Listen, they'll buy it. <laughs> They'll happily buy it, of course. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to have to go back to Cadrino Chaos, which has some. Okay. Well, so it's back and forth until, until we can do that. Oh, my gosh. Okay, farming from these guys. Refinery here. I'd like to do some patrolling and make these guys like me a little more, but... Vodka. How much they got? 25 units. Baby. Alright. Back and forth. I am your ferryman. Off we go. A spy. Acknowledge. I should demand tribute. I haven't done that yet. It... It knocks down your reputation, but if you have a ton of reputation with somebody, it's pretty good. All right, store it. We have moved 50 units to a secret cache. Okay, so. Map, if we go like this. This, system chaos. Where was it? Where was the place we were buying them from? I can't remember the name of the place. We'll find out. I can not engine and move on. <clears> Who <throat> I should do that for? Grab the money. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay. Emergency jump. That's not good. Component damage, morale damage, all that jazz. Morale damage, land, fuel, pay people their wages. Oh, goodness. Buy cargo. Vodka. How much can I get from you? Another 25? Awesome. They're making it. That's all right. We're going to... Try to get rid of some of this morale problem. They don't have any more. Okay. All right. So this is Draxus. All right. Draxus. Got to remember to go back to that place. Excellent. Stash. Now we got 75 units. How much do we have to do for this whole thing? 112? Yeah. Okay. Well. Off we go. Draxus. System Atlas. Draxus. Right there. Be my huckleberry. Give me all the vodka. Tie. There's protection. Oh, that's... If it was Steel Song, since I have so much rep with him, I'd probably do it. 
spy. Uh-oh. Yeah, I forgot to buy fuel once again. Oh my gosh. Don't forget to do that. Buy the fuel. Pay the crew their wages. Now only one person is unhappy. Okay. They're a little beat up, but we can live with that. Two more trips, and we'll have the vodka handled. And buy, unless we run out here, which could very much happen. So there's only six units. Oh, okay. Yeah, I suspected that was going to happen. All right, let's look for the next place here. What's going to have it? Uh, Alta Mesa Farming has it. And it's 7 AU away. Let's go. Land. Give me all your vodka. 14 units. That still not loaded us up. So we took all of that. Okay. Who else might have it? Orbital station. Formosa. Out of my way, bounty hunter. Uh, we already got minus 12 rep with these guys. I don't want to lose access. New trait, fatalistic. Vodka. Okay, give me those. How do you tell how many they have to sell? That's what I that's what I haven't been seeing. Cause this is the legality, so it doesn't tell you the amount. I'd like to know how much they actually have. Somehow I'm missing it. Okay. One more trip. Oh my goodness. Skip off the void. We're gonna have to do some repairs soon, but we've We've managed to do four hauls, and we probably still have like a year left. We'll look at that in a minute. Ship took damage. Land. Dump it off. We're so close now, and how much time do we have left? Three years and 50 weeks. Okay, great. And then... Because we've got some stuff that's that's getting short that we've got to spend some time on. So, orbit, land, pay the crew, buy the fuel, heal your members. That took a week. Repair nine items for 14k. That took eight weeks. Okay. All right. Off we go. Who, who were we at? Formosa or whatever it was called. Right. Just pick one. Navigate. There seems to be a bunch of budkin in that system, so... Hopefully. And we apparently have the right trade permit to do it. Mieu. Formosa, yeah. They were like the last system we stopped at. We just need 12. We don't need 25. We just need 12. Buy cargo. How much vodka you got for me? 18 units. I only need 12. You're brilliant. Thank you. Excellent. Awesome. Ocean of vodka. Well, somebody's getting drunk. Uh oh, here comes our buddies again. Ship report. Yeah, yeah. We're not messing with that. See ya. Bye. Excellent. We'll get this part done. Then we gotta then we gotta do the rest of it. It seems something like it might be a little bit confusing to me. Alright. A huge reservoir of vodka is finally assembled. You could fill the pit with it and go for a swim. 
We scored a major win for our smuggler's crowning plan. And we got paid. That was the nice part. It's all about the money, people. The money. Prepare one item. Spice leave to make one person happy. And a whole bunch of people to level up. So let's go do that. Talents for your mechanics. Discounted repairs. That's always nice. Uh, buff ship with reactor points. I don't want to use that one because it self-inflicts component damage. Um, salvage the wreck of a destroyed ship for valuable scrap at 10%. Plus your repair skill to your profits and repair equal to your own hull. I like that one a lot, uh, actually. That's really nice for blowing ships up, which I like to do. Zagana. Okay. One crew member has that one. One crew member has this one. This reduces shield, so I want to at least have that one duplicated a couple of times. Black market, remove a risk card, storm shielding. Let's see what else. This, we got two people who know that. Salvaging, which we don't do. Spine, reroll a risk card, we got tons of those. Vigilant scanners, boosted shields, we have two of each of those. Let's just get three of each of those then, just so we have. e -techs seem to have some of the least interesting traits. Like we have one of those. Let's get two for redundancy, but they just, they don't super impress me. Crew dog. See, he's got good ones. Patrol, re-roll re a risk card. <laughs> yes. Blockade, re-roll a risk card. <laughs> yes. Um... Automatically passes a failed electronics test. Uh, I'm going to do the blockade one though. I don't, we, only, we don't have a lot of those cards, and blockading is something you do a lot as a bounty hunter type. So, purge your ship's crew and ship of both of them at the same time, which is just awesome. Purge them of bad effects. That's great. And our medical doctor, doctor. Still need two crew, but I know what I want. Um, I want a scientist and I want an explorer. <laughs> they have some great stuff. So, map next. Next targeted officer. Fifth divide. Forty-seven weeks. We gotta go get this guy. Okay. Planned demand. One jump to where? Where are we going? We should check its economy and prepare. Okay, so what do we actually have to do in this system? We should check its economy. I'm not sure what we have to do. Um, surrender to looting, because guess what? We don't have anything to loot. <laughs> Too bad, suckers. We hid all the vodka. There's nothing for you now. What do we have to do? We just have to go check its economy there? Okay. This is war, and in war, the only crime is to lose, he says. Yeah, we've already covered that before. And now, steady. The time aboard the ship has changed. Calliope swung. All right. So what do we have to do? Just look. Buy cargo. Sell cargo. Does that get us what we need? Planned demand. If we can help our criminal contact execute the crown and plan, this zone will suffer a planned shortage. We should check its economy and prepare to sell goods here for a profit. Okay. Is there anything else I have to do for that other than just take notes myself? Hmm. Okay, I'm going to look something up then. Right. So apparently all you have to do is take note and stockpile stuff. This is on, this is on you to to handle it however you want to handle it so we're in here looking you know like what kind of cargo did they want to buy um that's it's, the thing to do here is go through all the planets in this system because this is going to be one of the systems that 
handles this and look at what they're buying and look at the prices and look at maybe what the possible best thing is to buy with the most profit margin with trade permit that you can handle and then to stockpile those things on let's see on various planets well we still can't see it there i'll show you so on these little planets like this indie worlds you want to stash stuff there that you can sell here in this system where there's going to be a shortage so the smart thing to do is methodically go through here and figure out what are these guys buying power generators require a permit for um i need to figure out what kind of permit i have that's the next thing to do so you can go down here to your contact not contacts you go down here to faction politics and at any point in time you can click on each one of these individually and see what kind of free trader rank you have what kind of trader rank you have and what kind of badge of edict you have adept rank with steel song right now the only trade we have the only trade permit we have is with steel song it's free trader permit two <coughs> and same thing there with the luxury clothing uh, permit rank what's the rank you need for those you need a spice traders rank one to trade with those so what we should do then is for clan Altamesa is raise our rep find a contact get in good with them raise enough faction with them and get a traders permit before all this goes down we still have some time we have quite a bit of time so that's kind of the plan for right now that's what i'm gonna think about doing so in this other system over here, these are the, these are the things we're going to be targeting, I guess. And she's a she's an ex mercenary, Giselle. Remember, we were trying to get in good with her, and we keep failing to do so. Um, can she offer trade permits though? No. So it doesn't really matter. She had combat armor. We'll have to find somebody close by that can give us a trade permit. But let's go back to orbit. That was there, the East Wind Port over here on the farming land they would buy a bunch of stuff and clothing would be the best thing so not such a big deal um you could stockpile that stuff but that's fine so let's go back to the map this is and this is at fesaden so over here we have jeanette now let's do the smart thing here and look for let's see learn rumors trade conditioning don't care about that rare trade goods that's a thing to possibly look at i want to look at trade though what would that what would the right here permits for clan Mason. who handles them and who's close 13 au for her otherwise we gotta go get somebody who can jump she yeah so let's go look at her Let's see what kind of job we can do for her. In the meantime, also, let's raise our just rep overall. Let's do some patrolling. For instance, there's some right there. Oh, please. Disparage our reputation, Clan Maklemune. So we'll try to do this to get ourselves yeah linked rumors woohoo fuel and turns get rid of those uh not a single well strike and blow in a conflict i guess actually counts that would get you some points uh military officers so we can submit to us an inspection Let's just get that. I don't want to pay bribes anymore. I just <laughs> don't want to do it. We lost one rep with Steel Song. That's fine. Okay. That gets us to minus two and then a bunch of negatives. Well, Malarkey, we rolled that one. <laughs> oh, we're so close. Oh. I don't want to fight. Who is this? It's oh. okay. Bounty hunter. We lost one rep, so now we're at minus three. 
Hmm, what's this? Replace with the reputation bonus of conflict interest. There's there's this is gonna give us three possible possibilities. Oh, and we got none of them. I hate doing that. I do that and then I get none of them. That happens so often. Oh my gosh. I can't believe how many times that has happened. You put three cards up there that can benefit you and you get none of them. It's like, what are the odds? But that's just... That's just my luck. I mean, you've all... Those of you who've been around since my XCOM series know what my luck is like. Um, I think I've told this story before, but it, it might have been a long time ago. M my ex-wife was notoriously lucky. Which is why after the first couple of times I, I played dice games against her, I stopped doing it. We we played Yahtzee a couple of times. And I used to be... I mean, I know how to play the game. Yahtzee's fun. We used to play it up at our lake cabin all the time. Uh, it's great as kids. You know, we'd have four, five, six people playing Yahtzee at, at one time. But it was no fun to play against her because she was that lucky and I'm that unlucky. So forget about it i mean she could just roll the dice and i was i i, I kind of wanted to take her to vegas and have her play craps or something it was like amazing how good she was at that okay protected by trade permit all right so we've got some some of that but i, I just i'm i'm no good with like so it's it's always hard thing all right so effective rep is four all right do we have intel records to sell? No. Darn it. That would have made it easier. Trade permits. Can you... Uh, you need my trust, don't you? Okay. Um, hmm. What's this mission? <gasps> ten, 10 jumps for 116? It's a long way to go, sister. Hmm. Spy war. We're good at spying. Two jumps for what? Provides 27 units of vodka. <laughs> no. No. I'm done with the vodka. <laughs> no. Can you give me this one? Oh, I should only give you the two. I hate that. Okay, I'm not doing the vodka thing. Again, that's... That's two jumps. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is it two jumps or is it in this system where all the vodka is? Let's look again. Cadrino Chaos. All the vodka's in this system. So, okay. Let's see. What do we have? Orbital farming. Those guys don't have any vodka. Who has vodka? Farming. Clan Altamesa farming. Refinery. Refinery and farming. Farming. They don't have any vodka to sell. Farming. They have some vodka to sell. Okay, all right. If it's gonna earn your trust, and I don't have to fly eight thousand miles, then let's go. Let's do this. No, 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 wrong one. Oh my god, I almost hit the wrong one. All right, let's go find you some vodka then. Let's roll down here. Refinery. They're not selling it. This one, farming. They're selling it. All right, let's do it. Let's get her her vodka. I need those trade permits. I need a trade permit of four, and then I can stockpile all that stuff. Meanwhile, I gotta like not be stupid here. 14 units. Are you killing me, Smalls? Okay. Any other systems here that we haven't been to that might possibly sell it? This is Alta Mesa Farming. It's right here. That's all they have. The high tech doesn't have it. They don't have it. Even though they're Javit farming. It's a refinery. It says it doesn't have any. But this is, our last landing was 47 weeks, 7 days ago. Let's go visit because maybe that maybe the situation has changed. I don't know if the game keeps everything static or if it actually changes. So Let's... It... I don't see the vodka anyway. Okay. Let's do this. Who else? Who else? Orbital Station won't have it. High Tech won't have it. This farming we don't know about, so let's go. Let's go look at them. We haven't ever landed there. <gasps> and there's a spy. 
Oh, well. You know how this works, right? You're a spy. I mean, I'm sorry, but. Yeah. I gotta pay for all this vodka. Ah. <laughs> uh. I'll, I gotta pay for all these all these components that I'm going to be trying to store these power generators, which would be great. So uh, let's keep twitching just to make sure we get up there as fast as we can because this might skip two steps, which would be great. It's got a 10% chance to do it. Not that those are good odds for me, but you know. Three. Let's keep them from going anywhere. Shields. Actually, what's this? Do I have any any other good ones that stop them from moving? Rate change. That's what I want. Let's go, baby. Ooh, you think you can shoot me? Let me tell you. Let me tell you how this is going to work. Okay? Like this. I got three weapons here. And they shoot just like that. How does that make you feel? Makes me feel pretty good. I don't want you to hit me anymore, so... I'm going to add 25 defense while I make myself more accurate. Now here comes the big bombs. Alright. Accuracy, damage... Mmm, yummy. And the broadside, which is now going to add copious amounts of damage. Give me the big stuff. Give me the big numbers. Big numbers, big numbers, no way me stop. 298 crit, 241. He's still not dead. Wow. Well, guess what? I don't have to burn anything else except if I want to fix, uh, if... Do I have... I still don't have, like, the patch one, do I? Oh my gosh, I don't. Okay. Oh, he hit me. Sucker. 330 crit. That's not too bad. Come on. Come on, baby. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna heal ourselves. We can't do anymore. That's all the damage we had. That's awesome. Okay, no components were damaged. Orchestrated salvage. Gives you 37.5k. Yay. Land, show me what you got. It's not vodka. <laughs> it's, it's not vodka. How long to heal? Two days to heal people? Okay. So, what is this? Refinery. But have we been there? Farming. Refinery. We've been there. They have vodka. They're what? Eight AUs away? Okay, retreat. I don't want to bribe people. Submit to inspection. Oh, no, no. Let's not do that. Okay, that worked. Kabingo, what do you got for me? Vodka. Okay. So this is... Orbit. Back. This is Narfland. Well now. Drinkable reserves. 50 weeks. Ooh. Targeted officer. Where is that at? Fifth divide. It's one jump. We gotta go take care of that before it expires. It's 27 weeks. Let's go do that. It's worth money. Remember. We're trying. We're trying to get a, a big fat ship. We need a big fat ship before a couple more events show up later on. One of those being a super bad aliens. We also need our crew to have the highest tier gear we can get our hands on. So that's, that's part of what this is all about. All right, targeted. 
At 27 weeks, we're probably down to 25 weeks on this thing. By the time we get there, maybe less. Target is officer, 24 weeks. Let's blockade his butt. That didn't do it. I need fuel. Oh, Clan Zenrin. I don't want to lose reputation with Clan Zenrin. No. Give me mission success. There we go. Now we're going to fight. Fight. Oh, he's a little tiny ship. Ooh, 1250, level seven, 16. Sorry about that. Jeez, that sucks. Hold on. Hopefully I managed to edit out that coughing fit there correctly. All right. Let's do this. Off we go. Punxsutawney. Ooh, ooh, he's very accurate for a little guy. Okay. Well... What did the log say about that? Hmm. 36 versus 35. Okay. Well, what that tells me then is if we want to add a little bit of defense here, might be able to make him miss. Target lock. Actually, you know what? This standard range change damage thing. Let's do this. So what did that look like? There were two misses there. Here's something. The log. Here's what the log needs to do. Trace Brothers, reverse this order. Don't make us scroll down. Put the most recent turn at the top. Trust me as a person who has written many a log file and report analyzer and other pieces of software. People want to see the most recent thing at the top. Every business person in the world will tell you this. Yeah, okay, fine, but I need to see the most recent thing first. This having to scroll through here, especially without a scroll bar to speed it up, that's that's no good. So uh, okay, so now, but miss, 31 versus 34. All right. Just a little bit, 34 versus 37. All right. Now, let's get busy. <clears throat> hammer away. So you'll hammer later? that hurt yet not enough it doesn't hurt you enough yet okay well in that case let's do this it takes take some of your shields down too so it hurts a little bit more oh he got his hands on me again because my defense went away oh but it doesn't matter he's done all right targeted person yay orc orchestrated salvage yeah baby we get paid 64k for our part in destroying that person, which is fantastic. Three weeks. Oh, that's bad. Okay. Heal my crew members. Two weeks. Oh, that really hurts. That all really hurts. Because that makes the vodka thing, the timeline, tighter. Okay. Let's go then. Here's some vodka. <laughs> then we'll try to get you the rest. Hey, look. Vodka. Drinkable reserves. Alright. 27 units. I gotta find two more. 
<laughs> I gotta find two more. Oh my gosh. Okay, map. Who's got two more? Uh, <laughs> do you guys have two more yet? See, that's the thing, is it could be anywhere. Any of these could have it. Because <clears throat> it replenishes over time, right? So, a few years have passed since the United Coalition was formed. The emissaries are obvious in the starports. Alright. The gloves will be coming off soon. The early Coalition era has ended. Such a time of relative peace was unlikely to last. The factions have settled into a new era, that of the third century. So, yay for them. Buy cargo. Give me vodka. There's some. I only need two. Oh my gosh. It's going to give me two. Awesome. Okay. Then I got to start soon finding those things I want to buy <laughs> that I can stockpile. Okay. Drinkable reserves. Yay, we got paid. Excellent. And this gives us rep with Vala Hajor. Alright, Vala. Right here. Two, she's two jumps away, though. Oh my gosh. Okay, well. Hmm. And that still didn't buy us a lot with her. <laughs> Oh man, this guy, what's Jericho? He's a, He also has access to trade permits up to rank three. She has trade permits up to rank four. I should have been paying attention to that part. Up to rank two, up to rank one. So we still couldn't get a trade permit rank four, could we? Mm. Now that doesn't, that's not necessarily a bad thing. Um, well, it is. You gotta get a trade permit before this goes live. We have to come in contact with somebody who can get us a better trade permit. So it's maybe not worth worrying so much about until we can run into that contact. If we want to sell those things. If we just want to make money off of like, you know, luxury clothing or something like that, that'd be a thing to do. Let's go navigate to this fella and take a look at him. And maybe we can get a trade permit. At least a level one trade permit, which a lot, which is, would allow us to stockpile luxury clothing and, and plan for that. Smuggler Prince. Okay. I don't suppose you just give me one. Nope. All right. Spy War. I'm very good at spying. Oh my God! You want to spend so much money to go there? So far away. Increase my friend and ally. Oh, we don't have, we don't do that. Okay, so this is the only thing we can do. Alpha Red Swath, it's like way up here. It's way over here. Oh my gosh, but we have one right there at the Nadella Vortex. Oh, well in that case, since we're going to do that. Oh, we'll just accept that mission then. Okay. Well, it's going to be the end for Lucky Episode 13. Um... Yeah, this is three years. This is six years. We still got nine years to try to get re ready for this uh, crowning offer. Okay, invited to run missions to help him happen. I'm going to go check this person out next then. That's how we're going to end this episode. Go over here first. Get some fuel. Let's see how many of these things we can do. Spi. Demand tribute. <laughs> Our earnings have been increased in percent. Oh, that's funny. Retreat. We lost one rep with them doing that. Okay. I got some people I need to level up here. Might just do it between episodes. So let's take a look here. This person. He's always an independent. Wait a minute, what's going on? We know about her. 
she can give us a level one permit. Okay. And she can't give us the next one. Beyond the contact max. But at least we got a level one. Okay. That's cool. Well then. Hmm. I guess that's it for this episode. I gotta... I gotta hope we run into somebody who can get us a level four trade permit. But if we can't... We gotta start targeting level one goods that we can move when this happens. So, um, so we're supposed to do missions for her? Is that the thing? Let's go look at this real quick. This is local. Crowning. Our criminal contact has a plan to take the crown of Smuggler Prince and send it to a new position with the Underworld. We've been invited to help her on missions to make this happen. Okay. So we just have to do missions for her. What kind of missions does she have? One way, jump. One crystal at a time. Another one of these huge... Oh my gosh. Raw spice. Oh, jeez. Okay. Well. Now I gotta find rice spot, raw spice in, in huge quantities. Oh, brother. It's like the vodka one. It's a nightmare. <laughs> I might have to splurge for the bigger cargo holds and forego some of the excess gas that we're carrying around. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. As always, if you dig it, subscribe to the channel. Drop questions and comments down below. Subscribe. Do all that jazz. Patreon's listed in the description below. I'll see you all next time. Thanks for watching.